DIY essential oil perfume blend. That's what we're making today. You heard it right. We are making perfume. <laughs> Some of you might be saying, wait a minute, Megan. You always tell us to get rid of the perfumes, get rid of the fragrance. And I am still telling you, ditch those. Ditch any of the synthetic fragrances, those nasty chemicals, because we know they can cause cancer and they can have endocrine disruptors in your body which mess with your hormone levels and they can cause breathing problems and inflammation and so many more issues we won't get into today. That's for th Throw It Away Thursday. But today on Make It Monday, I'm gonna show you how to make an all natural essential oil DIY perfume. So this blend that I'm gonna show you today is my personal favorite and I have named it Happy Day because who doesn't need a little bit of happiness in their life? I know I sure need it all day long. <laughs> and it smells amazing. People are constantly coming up to me saying, what are you wearing that smells so good? And I'm like, just my essential oils. And it makes me happy at the same time and doesn't cause all these issues in my body. So let's get started. What I'm holding right here is I actually ordered on Amazon. Now you can choose to use a regular spray bottle, you can clean out an old perfume bottle, you can use an old essential oil bottle, you can use a roller, whatever you want. I just thought this was kind of fun and I love it. It has all different colors and it's really easy. It's got a little spray bottle and you take this piece off and inside it's glass, which is great because you can use any of your citrus oils and not have to worry about it pulling toxins out of the plastic. Take off this little part and there you go. How cool is that? And this is a little spray part. So I'm gonna start my Happy Day blend with three drops of lavender. Lavender, lemon, and peppermint are three that most people agree with. Everybody's sense of smell is different and uh, most people really enjoy lavender, um, peppermint, which I'm using right now, and lemon. I'm also doing three drops of peppermint in there. Peppermint is very uplifting and smells very sweet and minty, and lavender is just so relaxing and calming and has a wonderful smell as well. And the third one is three drops of lemon. Lemon, again, uh, so fruity and fresh. I mean, you just feel so clean afterwards and um, about three drops lemon comes out fast so I think I got about four in there no problem and you can switch up the amount or take out any of these it's totally up to you this is personal preference this is your perfume you're making your own scent um, these are just the this is just what I love so those three right there your lemon lavender and peppermint make up your seasonal blend, which is great, because if you have any trouble during those change of season times, this will help you out <laughs> and smell great on you. So the next one is frankincense. If you know me, you know I love adding frank to anything. Frankincense, I, I do about six drops of frankincense in this Happy Day blend. Frankincense is great for, um, you know, some moments of sadness or despair it really helps to lift your your spirits it is if i must say it's just good for your soul like frankincense is just good for overall wellness makes you feel wonderful it's so amazing on your skin so i love having it in here in fact now that i'm talking about it and smelling it ah oh, i love it i'm gonna add a little more if you don't like the smell of frank frankincense then don't add it in totally up to you okay so now here you get to choose. I have made this before with Stress Away and adding about six to 10 drops of Stress Away, which is a great blend. It does exactly what it says. But today and most of the time, I choose Peace and Calming. That is one that I, is one of my personal favorites. And it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, I just love the smell of Peace and Calming. Mm. You could check out some of my um, top chip tips and you can see more about how I use um, Peace and Calming, but it smells amazing. So you can either use Peace and Calming or Stress Away. It's your personal preference. Or you can choose Valor or White Angelica. Really up to you. And last but not least, 
I'm going to sweeten it up. So this is a perfume and I love um, sweet floral smells. If you don't, cool, that's it. You can add a few more of any of those other ones that are your per personal preference, but if you want something a little bit sweeter on, um, on that end, I would recommend either Joy, which is a great blend and it does what it says, or Geranium. So I am going to add Geranium to mine right now. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. So you've got it about half full. Let's see. Mmm, smelling really good right now. I think I would like to add, now here's where you get to have a little fun. You can play around with it. I think I'm gonna add a little bit more of the lemon, or I am gonna add a little more lemon, because it's summertime and I just feel like I wanna add a little more of that today. So you, if you're gonna do a roller ball, you can do a carrier oil. What I'm gonna do right now, since this is my spray bottle, is I'm gonna add a little bit of witch hazel. I also ordered this on Amazon. Um, I choose this a witch hazel because it is alcohol free. And this particular one is a rose petal, which is amazing. So um, you can get the unscented one, or this one has um, rose petal in it. It smells so yummy. And then I'm going to put the top back on, screw that on, and you can see it separates in there. So you're going to want to shake it up before you start spraying it on yourself. And then I'm going to put it in the bottom, and now I'm ready to spray it right on. Oh my goodness, that is heavenly. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy my Smart Day blend and your DIY perfume. Please comment below and let me know which are your favorites to wear for your perfume and um, wh what else you would like to hear me do for you guys for, for Make It Mondays. So enjoy. Don't forget if you're enjoying my videos, click on the subscribe button and also on the little bell, tap the bell, and that way you'll get informed whenever I post a new video. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.